Hey guys, welcome back to another DIY video. For today's video, I'll be showing you how I upcycled a coffee bottle into a nice piece of home decor. For this project, I'll be using a stone-like flat interior paint color, paintbrush, a bowl and mixing stick, some baking soda, and I'll also be using a foam brush later in the video. You're gonna wanna start by removing the sticker from the bottle. It was pretty easy for me. If you have any trouble, just use some Windex and it should come right off. Before you begin, you'll want to mix your paint and give it a good stir so that it is true to color once you start painting. You'll wanna coat it about three to four times to cover every inch of glass. And you'll see that I added an extra baking soda throughout each coat to give it some good texture for the more organic look. And while I have you guys here, I do want to say that I hope y'all are having a great new year so far. I know last year was difficult for a lot of us. I know that a lot of us do set new year resolutions, whether it's weight loss to working more. So I am curious to know what's yours. Mine is to, of course, just embrace having my family more at home with me. I'm really taking advantage of this quarantine phase we're going through. And I'd also love to commit to creating more content for you guys. I have so much planned from freezer meal preps to clean with me's, grocery hauls, home projects, all of that good stuff. My entire upstairs media slash theater room is actually an entire mess right now, so I'll most likely be filming that makeover for y'all, but let me know what you guys would like to see. side of you that says I just have to follow that because you don't know who you're going to meet who you're going to meet who you're going to meet So this is how it's looking after the second coat. You can still see some of the letters and I wasn't feeling too much of the brush strokes but that's okay because I'll be adding in more baking soda and smearing it on with a foam brush which should help hide the letters. <laughs>
aircraft and nothing's working, but there's something inside of you that says, I just have to follow that. Because you don't know who you're going to know who you're going to know who you're going to meet. Always think of you when spring comes. Like it's something in the air at that time. Don't know why. Always dream of you when spring comes. It's like the heat on my skin takes me back to the time. Now, on to the final step. I'm gonna lightly smear some coffee grounds for a more distressed look. I really love the aged and organic look. You can even try using mud for a more dramatic effect. But this is how it came out. This is one of my favorite coffees to drink, so I'm glad I was able to recycle the glass and have it as a piece of decor in my home. If you enjoyed today's video, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe, and I'll see you guys for the next video. Bye.